I almost took a selfie instead of starting the video, but not today. What's going on, Boosted Mop? So I'm excited because if you don't know um, that it is, uh, I don't know what I was doing with my hand there, but if you don't know, today is the Big Ten Championship. Ohio State is going to get its crown. It's <laughs> a guarantee. The question is, how many points do we score other than that, it was Black Friday, so I picked up a couple of things, and when I mean a couple of things, I literally mean two things. One, I got on my feet, I'm about to show you right now. Oh, look at these right here, guys. I got the black Yeezys with the reflective laces. I'm pretty pumped about these. I missed the first Yeezy release, the better ones, I'm not gonna lie, these are like the knockoff ones, but they're still Yeezys, and I'm happy. I love black shoes. I love how comfortable Yeezys are, so he's about to be my new go-to. The next thing is I picked up one part from Greg Race Parts. I wanted to, the people beat me. Man, did everybody want the GT4 Carbon Side Scoops. I'm still on the hook for trying to get those in Gloss Carbon. I missed out on the Black Friday deal, but I did pick up some paddles because I love the aluminum paddles I had in the M3, and I hated these little dinky ones I had in the Bora. I'll show you those, I'll show you the new ones in just a second, and I'm gonna do a very, very quick DIY install. It'll probably take me like five minutes, and then it's game time. So stay with me and stay tuned. Also, you might be wondering, what in the heck is this ladder here for? Yeah, I'm way, way up in my ceiling, these are like, Story uh, of four years. I, I want to say 24 feet uh, of height, but I just installed. I'm going to show you real quick what took me all week to do, but pretty proud about it. We installed two of these bad boys. We painted the inner things gloss black, we painted the candle stalks copper, and we have these both up. So I'm going to go ahead and climb down real quick. Woo! I did not jump from the top. Enough about that, let's get to the good stuff. And by good stuff, I mean these right here. Whoa, look how big they are. You can see the carbon on those bad boys. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and pull the car out, but let's get these in. So remember guys, foot on the brake, put the key in. We still gotta put keys in cars in 2019, baby. Press, oh God this button yeah we are off <clears throat> all right i'm gonna add on these little paddles right here. What I mean by add-on is that these don't replace the paddle mechanism. It's just kind of an overlay that you put on top of these paddles and it creates the extension. So it's gonna be a lot bigger. And I'll show you what I mean by that. Basically what, what it came with, you got this little baggie of tools. You have black screws or silver screws, depending on how you're feeling. I'm definitely doing the black screws. You have a little Allen wrench to screw it together. He gives you a little bit of foam tape because there might be a little wiggle room when you put this in because it's CNC. And I'll show you what I'm saying here real quick. Let me open this baggie. So you can see this is the thing. You pull the carbon off nice and gently. Boom, that, 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 looks, that looks like it makes sense, right? So there may be a little wiggle room and that's what the foam's for. You put that on the back side just like that. And look how much bigger these are going to be. I'm pretty happy about that. It's gonna be, it's gonna be nice. It's gonna add some flair. So I got the foam piece on there. It's not sexy. There's nothing fancy about this. I really don't know if I actually needed it, but I put it on anyways. And now I take this, stuff that on in there. And that's, that's basically that guys. I'm gonna put the face on, screw it in. And I'll show you guys the end result. That's in a knot. That, that's a, that's not in my favorite place. Oh, can never be too easy, you know? Wow, this, this has got to stop. Wow, 
Wowzers. So nice he provides this for you, but you know, the reach in there is uh, left to be desired for. Okay. my family so i went to go get tacos before i was supposed to go to and i run into this guy this wasn't even he showed up here and then i happened to have the way he was at we both were craving omg tacos Hello. and uh we're about to go head back to his new house park cars get in another car head downtown and watch ohio state get a big fat dub get that dub, get that dub. <laughs> right right audi right. ain't nothing but w's over here that's right. He, he knows what it is. He knows what it is. Also, guys, the paddles are nice, but you can see they block the view. So that's the only con, but they feel so good. That nice little metal. I got to roll, though, because he's trying to leave me. So I'll talk more about these paddles later. Again, guys, I took a selfie instead of a video. <laughs> I got so many hidden selfies. We are on our way to watch victory. Woo! Ain't that right? Oh, H. I O, baby. That's what I like to hear. Sorry for all my uh, Baylor? It's Baylor. Baylor yeah, fans. Baylor. It's tough loss, boys. Tough loss. Y'all tried hard. And to my Georgia folk, man, that's on y'all. I can't even apologize for that shit. That's on y'all. <laughs> it's not even done yet. Man. All right. At the 10, Cole steps up, runs it, and, 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 and Cole, oh, he got drilled, wow, Josh Proctor, and that is the end of the game. What a way to end this game with a big hit, I respect his determination. Yeah. The out of hell. Wow, they had us in the first half. I'm not gonna lie. They came and brought their best game. 27 unanswered points in the second half, baby. Oh man, it was it was it was scary in the first half. I lost my voice. It got rowdy in the second. I got like rebirth along with my team. Uh Yes, I ain't gonna be talking no more sh the rest of the year though, cause it was looking scary. And I was gonna regret having to drop the video with all that sh talking I was doing. <laughs> so I'm still repping the squad. Uh, we're up against Clemson, coming soon. I hope we bring her A game. I can't do another fiasco like we saw at the Big Ten Championship, but I'm excited to see where my alma mater takes me. But I told you guys I'd talk a little bit about the paddles. And in all honesty, there's not much to say. They're paddles. But they are very cool. They feel great. They have this cool metal feel instead of just the plasticky feel of the Oleum paddles. So I like that. It makes it feel a little bit more engaging. 
for those who have paddles and it's only i mean how engaging can it get right but anyways they're pretty cool i will say uh i would have preferred a different design i like the ones that are on my m3 they have the holes through the paddles um and but it is what it is i guess it's probably just due to the mechanics of how the paddles work for why they, a lot of the brands I saw, like only two other brands out there, and they all do like overlays instead of like building a full uh, paddle that can be integrated into the original Switch. But whatever. Also, it's Christmas time soon. So I'm hoping I get some more carbon parts. I've really wanted to dress up the interior, like the steering wheel with the carbon fiber uh, piece, the center thing with the carbon fiber, the carbon fiber over the dashboard, the carbon fiber uh, side skirts. So when you open the door, it's so cool to look at. And then the carbon fiber door sill. So it's just carbon fiber everywhere. I really want to do that, um, but we'll see. It Once you start listing everything I just said and pricing, you're like, it's like two, three grand. You're like, Jesus Christ, just for some carbon. But uh, I've also been not patiently waiting for BOE to drop the tune. They, I, I go on Lotus Talk like every day and BOE Fab looking for an update. Like, is the tune out? Is there an update? How much power are we making? I want more power. So hopefully the start of the next year, there's some cool new stuff for the car performance wise. Ultimately, I would love headers with a tune and getting the Comotech top tier power band, but we'll see. With that though, as I conclude this video, I know it was very short on the Lotus content. I know I have been short on Lotus content in recent time, but that's because I've been traveling a lot uh, due to work. But with Christmas coming up, who has mods on the list? What do you guys got coming? I'd like to know like what's on the top thing of your list to uh, get your car for Christmas. Once again, thanks for checking out the channel. Like, subscribe, leave some comments. Tell me the video shit if that's what you think. I don't care. Just interact with me. And hopefully I get out on some drives soon. It was actually nice when I landed today. And I hope it continues to stay nice so I can get on out there.